Highest David the Drive Green here. Got a nice and Volkswagen e Golf hit with just over 6,200 miles. And it's in absolutely lovely condition. It's sort of like a tungsten silver color. And it's got the upgraded alloys and some leather seats as well. So let's jump straight in. Starting off with the passenger side alloy wheel. And there's no marks or issues on that at all. Coming around the paintwork. As you would expect a car with this age, not much in the way of issues at all. It's very clean, very tidy, no issues. Lovely headlight design on the e-golfs, um, especially with the running lights at the bottom there. It's all very nice. Looking at the driver side alloy, again, no issues, no marks. And we'll just take back and have a look at the car as a whole. Very clean. Lovely clean paintwork, and it is a lovely colour, this. Looking on the interior, as you can see, a full leather upholstery, heated seats, got navigation system, you've got the digital dash, which is all very nice. And the great thing with the e-Golf, it's a very familiar car to drive. So if you're used to a, a normal internal combustion engine Golf, no discernible difference in driving habits. You put into drive, auto handbrake goes off, and that's it. It's just a very nice drive. It's very quick and very quiet. So uh, it's a lovely, lovely car. And they've done a great conversion on this to electric. Internal rear space, nice and tidy, clean. And yeah, very, very nice. Just looking at the driver's rear alloy gate. Very clean, no issues there, it's all good. Coming on to the rear of the car. Coming into the boot. Again, very tidy, very, very tidy. So cars are standard come with a three pin charger. Should you want a type two or type two cable as well, do give us a shout and let us know, we can sort one out for you. That's your puncher repair kit and tools there. You've also got a slight cubby hole under the floor. So yeah, a usable boot space on this, it's pretty good. Uh, loading marks, hardly any on the bumper to be fair. It's very clean and tidy. And again, no marks on the lip of the boot. So that's all good. Coming around, just look down the general side of the car. And then finally looking at the rear passenger alloy again. No marks. These upgraded alloys do certainly stand out a bit more than the standard e-golf wheels, but it's a personal taste thing. And yeah, no marks on the wing mirror either. So a very clean and tidy golf. And if you're a VW fan and you've always liked golfs and you're thinking of switching to electric, this is probably on paper the best choice. And this spec is sensational. Very, very rarely see the full leather seats like this so this is a rare car and as such will be a popular one so do give us a call if you're interested and please do visit our youtube channel and subscribe all the best take care now bye